Avangrid, the parent company of Central Maine Power, is taking legal action after the company was accused of bid rigging and racketeering in a lawsuit filed this week. Good evening, I'm Sam Rogers. Yesterday, we reported Avangrid and its parent company, Iberdrola, were sued by a subcontractor that claimed to work for the companies. The lawsuit alleges Avangrid purchased millions of dollars worth of equipment and warehouses with no intention of using that infrastructure. Security Limits Incorporated CEO Paulo, S Paulo Silva filed the lawsuit. In it, he claims Avangrid could use those expenses as a reason to ask public utilities commissions to increase power rates among customers. Avangrid denied the allegations in that legal filing and today filed a defamation lawsuit against Silva. In a release sent to New Center, Maine, Avangrid filed the suit accusing he and his company of extortion. The company claims that the lawsuit was filed with intent as Avangrid is in a merger review process with an out-of-state power company. That merger process is happening in New Mexico, where Avangrid's lawsuit was filed. Extortion in that state is a third-degree felony. In a statement, Avangrid Senior Vice President and General Counsel R. Scott Mahoney said the company will vigorously defend itself against the meritless allegations. In fact, Avangrid has previously reviewed unsubstantiated allegations made by Silva's company, Security Limits Incorporated, and sent it a cease and desist letter. Today, Governor Janet Mills said she was unaware of the allegations made against Avangrid, adding, I call on the Maine Public Utilities Commission to closely review the federal complaint, to examine Avangrid's history of equipment purchases in Maine, and to ensure that no Maine CMP ratepayer has been or will be harmed by these activities if proven to be true. Now we have a lot more details on this story on our website and mobile app.